it's irrelevant to people, to society itself. What do you see? A photograph. Tell me about it. Man just in a suit with red nails. Well, when I look at it, I feel kind of weird. But I'm kind of into it as well. <sighs> the more I look at it, the more it seems like a mirror and I somehow see myself in it. Maybe the contrast between the man's suit and the red nails, in some way, this provokes my sexuality. The photo itself, I feel like it represents you, fashion. Well, when you put it that way, I guess you really did go through a lot to express yourself in motion. I'm a behavior in continuous evolution. I wish my parents were here face to face having this talk. But maybe they'd change their opinion. Why? Do you have a different mind now? Yeah. Mm. It's just the way they think, you know? They have this certain conception that you aren't relevant to society. Again, you just represent futility and consumerism. I mean, look at you. Yeah, look. You're beautiful and glamorous. And who's to say you're not using all this charm to convince me and society of something negative you're trying to hide? Because I'm sorry, I can't not question myself when I see a person spending a fortune on a bag when a child is starving. Or forced to manufacture that bag just to survive. Come on, something's wrong. I just find it interesting that you provide this to society. The way you turn things around, futility's now our, our fault and you're the hero. I'm not a hero. I don't know. I distinguish your heroes. Oh, well done with the Superman costume. <laughs> what? A man with his underwear on top of his leggings. <laughs> okay. What is your name? I'm Josefina.